Patterson. <laughs> okay. His eyes are so pretty. Move around in there. It's okay, bud. Harold is a fun cat. Harold's a cute cat. He is sweet. He's very relaxed. He just wants to sleep all day. Typical cat. Very sweet. He wants cuddles and sleep and treats. Harold is a very playful cat who likes to know where his family is at all times. He has deformed ears, but they're perfectly functional as far as we can tell. He is cuddly, a little feisty, but in the end very sweet.
Just stop your crying, it'll be all right. Just take my hand, hold it tight. Who will protect you from all around? I'll be here, don't you cry. For once so small, you seem so strong. My arms hold you, keep you safe and warm. The walls between us can't be broken. I don't know the words to this song. Cause you'll be in my heart. Cause you'll be in my heart. From this day on, now and forever. <laughs> well, Mom showed us a picture of him because we've been thinking of getting a cat. And she was like, look at this little cat. He has no ears and his name is Harold. Um, so we went to the Umatilla Humane Society to go meet him. And um, we walked in. It's their kitty cottage, they call it. And he was on the patio and he was over in the corner bathing in the sun. We petted him and Ollie picked him up. And I thought he would not like that at all, but Harold was completely fine with Ollie picking him up. And then I held him and he purred. And immediately I knew, this cat is comfortable with me. There's a bond here. And we just said, we'll take him. And so we did. My favorite memory of Harold is the time when he was in a box uh, for the first time. And Grace put her hand close to him and he attacked it as if it were a mouse. Usually he comes up and he jumps on you no matter what you're doing and he comes up and he wants to rub his face on your face first and then he usually sits down in like a little cat loaf position and then slowly he just flops on the side so you're holding him like right here like a little baby and then he tucks his head like into this your side and it's very cute. He sometimes snores. Probably when we got him at the Humane Society and um, I held him and he laid on my shoulder and purred. I don't know Harold well because I am one of the only member of the Pat Patterson family who does not live at home. So Harold does feels a little nervous when I'm around since I'm not his friend yet. But my favorite memory of Harold is when he let me pet him with the brush and he only tried to bite me one time. No, he just sometimes enough. bites the brush. Like he like he's I've seen him like chew on it before. <laughs> he oh, he closed his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> he's not even sleeping though, he's just like this. Yeah, maybe if I close my eyes you won't be here. <laughs>
crazy time. You've given us joy and comfort and entertainment, and we're very thankful for you. I love you.